For the last two years, a group of Hayward students have been working on a campus mural to celebrate cultural diversity as finishing touches are being made on the creative Yes. Um, for the past two years, uh, under uh, students in Andrew Kahn's Knight's art program at Hayward High School, have been creating a four-part mural in the school library. Each panel celebrates a cultural heritage represented by many of the school's students and thus the Hayward community. A diverse group of talented, dedicated youngsters work collaboratively to build or to paint this mural. Tonight, we would like Andrew is here to talk with you tonight to share with you that experience and to share that experience with our community. Andrew? Thanks. Thanks for inviting me and uh, letting me share this project with you. I believe we have some slides that are being queued up, and I'll just talk you through the slides. 25 Hayward High School students worked on this project. It's actually on a desk, not, not, not unlike the desk that you're seated. It was just supposed to be a uh, maybe a month project, couple month project. It turned into a uh, magnificent masterpiece. It started here with the students sketching with charcoal or using a pencil to sketch out the mural and, and all the, uh, the concept for the mural. This shows the early stages of the mural. That one was, the last one was the uh, Native American section of the mural. This one is the Asian or Pacific Islander section of the mural. This one changed quite a bit, as you'll see. The student that worked on this one was Megan Kelly, and this is some of her uh, beautiful work here on the Asian part of the mural. It was later changed because the students thought they could do even better. And I have a very high standard for uh, what work I want to see the students create, and they seem to even exceed that expectation, as you'll see. That's about midway in, the, in this Asian part of the mural. You can see how it changed. Another detail of that mural. A girl started this mural and she used several student assistants and then young He Han worked a lot on this mural. This is a student peering out of the uh, book drop. We thought that'd make a more interesting shot instead of just having the black space of the book, book drop. This is the uh, Latino section of the mural. It has a lot of detail in the uh, Aztec calendar. One great thing was that the students not only learn art skills, but they were able to learn about various cultures. A lot of them got to learn a lot about their own culture. So this mural is not just something that beautifies the school, but I, I'm hoping that it could be used as an educational tool for a long time. We students did a key to each of the icons uh, and symbols on the mural that, that's going to be in the library for people to access. I think when students do such a beautiful job on a mural, it, um, students are interested in what, what, what does this mean and what, what are the, some of the uh, symbols in the mural. This is the uh, African American mural. The scroll has uh, names of, boy, well, it must be over a couple hundred names of famous African people and also African American people. There's a detail of This one, a student named Shana Clay was uh, one of the main artists on this Native American mural. She put some of the heroes, uh, Native American heroes that she had in the mural. What ties the mural together is the uh, Native American. He starts a river of tears behind him, if you see that water uh, going behind him. And then the river continues into the other murals as a river into a waterfall into an ocean on each of the murals. So we thought that water is life and, and that's what unifies us all. Well, I'd like to thank you for letting me share this project with you. The mural will stand as a testimony to the positive effects of diversity on their campus. Thanks again.